Hey, I'm Christopher Gazelle, and I play drums in Rest Repose. And here I got my kit right here. It's uh, actually Jared Dines' kit for the shells. It's a Truth Custom kit. At the Rack Tom, I got a Truth Custom 12 inch diameter, 8 inch depth Rack Tom, uh, 14 by 12 floor tom, and 16 by 14 floor tom. For the snare, it's a 14 inch by 7 inch snare. Uh, I got die cast tubes on here and triple flange tubes for the rack toms and floor toms. For the heads, I got Remo Emperors uh, clear on top and bottom for all the toms. I got the Remo controlled sound for the snare and on the bottom the Hazy Ambassador snare. For cymbals, I have all Zildjian cymbals. The hi hats are 15 inch K light hats, a 19 inch A custom crash, 20 inch dark thin crash, 18 inch Oriental China, and a 21 inch sweet ride. I love uh, using this as a crash ride a lot uh, for big open choruses, it's great. The 19 inch A custom is pretty bright and it cuts a lot, so it's good for little accents in there. And then my main crash is the dark thin. It's not too bright, doesn't hurt your ears too much. Uh, it just helps blend in the sound and it's great for what Rust Suppose does. For sticks, I just started using the Zildjian 12 gauge sticks. They're about the size of a 2B. Um, I love these sticks, they work really well for me. A lot of the sticks in this diameter are also like 16 and a half inches usually. This one's 16 inches long and I love the feel of it. For hardware, I have all Pearl hardware. Uh, standard 900 series for all the Pearl stuff. And for the pedals, I have the Pearl Demon Direct Drives. Um, I love these pedals, they're super fast, they feel great, and I have no complaints with them at all. Alright, so we have our rack set up here, it's a little complicated. Basically I have a, a kick, direct line of bass, guitar stage left, guitar stage right, vocals dry, vocals wet, and a little trash snare mic, which is uh, just an SM58 right under my throne. All that runs into a split. The half of it goes to the front of the house, and then the other half goes into an X32 rack. We use this for our personal in-ear monitor system. Myself, uh, Fluff, our guitarist, and Tanner, our center vocalist, use the X32 with wireless in-ears, and it works great for that. We do custom in-ear mixes. I have it set up with the Behringer program where I can uh, basically adjust all the mixes right in here on the fly. It's all good to go From the X32 on the outputs for the in-ear monitors me and Tanner are on the Galaxy 1400 R's and T's and Fluff uses the Galaxy 1800. For our backtracks, uh, we run Ableton We have uh, samples in here and uh, Click track and backtracks run out into the X32 and we route those through our ears from there and it works great so far. No issues with the Ableton. No issues with our setup. We also have a bunch of lights running out of Ableton. Uh, it's all MIDI programmed. And that runs out of a, a DMX system here. For the uh, kick mic for my ears, I'm running a, a Shure Beta 91A inside the kick drum. It's mounted on a suspension mount made by Kelly Shu. It works great. It's isolated. It's right in the center. Um, I get a split of that, and front of house gets a split of that. I can EQ it uh, through the Behringer X32, which works out really well. I can get a nice, like, triggered sounding EQ kick on the kick in my ears, and I love it. Thanks for checking out my kit. Uh, I'm on tour out with Rest Repose. We are on the Distro Kid Presents American Safari Tour, We're going all around the US. So check us out on social media, and you can find all the dates there.